when you're given a data set and they're asking us to find, um, when they're asking us to find a, or to describe it in a box and whisker plot, the main important thing that we need to do is arrange everything from in order. And particularly, we like to do from least to greatest. So when I go ahead and write a number, when I find the lowest number, so I just kind of make a scan, and I see that 39.9 is the lowest number, I'm just going to put a little cross through it. So therefore, I know that I have already selected it. So therefore, I'm not going to keep on selecting um, any, keep on selecting the same number. The next number I see, and if I make a mistake, please just let me know. I see 42.9. Then I have 44.0. 44.2. Then I see 45.7. 46.7. Then I have 50.4. 50.8. 50.9. Fifty-one point four, and oops, I forgot fifty point eight. Right, two fifty point eights. Um, fifty-one point four, which I'm now starting to get off. Fifty-one point four, and then fifty-two point four. Does everybody follow me? How I at least arrange the data set there? Does everybody see that? Yes. OK, so to arrange a box and whisker plot, the first thing we're going to do is the easiest to is find the minimum and the maximum value. So I have my least value is going to be 39.9. And then my greatest value is 52.4. Does everybody see how I at least created the initial parts of my box and whisker? The least all the way to the greatest. Now, there's three, three quartiles that we're going to look at. Quartile 2 is the median of our data set. So remember, the median is going to be directly in the, um, the middle value when they're ordered. So I see that I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So therefore, 6 and 6 would split it halfway, right? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. One, two, three, four, five, six. So when you have an even data set, what you need to do then is find, when you're, when you're trying to find the median of an even data set, you need to find the mean. When you're trying to find the median and you have an even set of numbers, there's no number that's exactly in the middle, correct? So therefore, what you need to do is find the mean between your two middle numbers. So all I do to find the mean is I'll just do 46.7 plus 49.1, divide that by 2, and I get 47.9. Now, I want to put 47.9 relative on this kind of line, as if you could think of this as like a number line. So 47.9, I'd probably roughly say is going to be maybe right there. Does everybody? see what I did and understand what I did. Any questions? OK. So now the next set is we need to find quartile 1 and quartile 3. So quartile 1 is basically going to be the median of our lower set. And quartile 3 is going to be the median of our upper set. So therefore, again, we just count. We're not going to include our, median, our mean value. But we'll include 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So again, I need to find the middle number, which is going to be between these two. So I do, well, 44.0 plus 44.2 is going to be 44.1, which maybe we can say is forty-four point one. And then I go ahead and find the mean between these two, which would be 50.8. And then there's your box and whisker. Does everybody see how I created that? Anybody have any questions? Kylie, any questions? No? 